Again, to put it in perspective, it is roughly it's about, 200 to, it's about 200 to 250 people in a Mm, something tells me Manera Wilson doesn't look too impressed with Damien Hines' reply. Well, this happened yesterday in Topicals for Education when Lib Dems Manera Wilson asked this question. Amongst other cuts, the Department for Education has quietly slipped out the announcement that it is slashing funding for Now Teach, which has supported over a thousand people to switch careers and retrain as secondary teachers in shortage subjects such as science, maths, and modern languages. Why on earth is the government withdrawing funding when it is missing its teacher training targets by 50% in some of these subjects, when now teachers had such a brilliant track record in getting people to retrain as teachers? Well, first I must say the statistics you just gave on missing recruitment targets is, is incorrect and is frequently repeated but not right. But we do think that career changes are a very important part of people coming into this noble profession. We are continuing with our career changes uh, programme. We are not axing now teach, we are not re procuring it, so we are not extending it. Again, to put it in perspective, it is roughly it's about, 200 to two, it's about 200 to 250 people in a typical year out of about 7,000 career changes coming into teaching. So we are reassessing the best ways to attract more of them because we want to grow the number of career changes coming into teaching, teaching and make sure we go about it in the very best and most productive way. Well, fancy that. Fancy Manera Wilson bringing in false information into the House of Commons. Disgraceful. I do hope your conscience got the better of you and you call for a point of order to correct the record, Manera. Thank you, Mr Deputy Speaker. On a point of order, earlier today, the Minister for School Standards said that the statistic I quoted on secondary teacher recruitment targets was incorrect, often repeated and not right. I'm afraid it's the Minister himself who was incorrect. The Department for Education's own website states in bold that 50% of the ITT recruitment target for secondary teachers was reached in 2023-2024, which is what I said. And in uh, raw numbers, that's 13,102 secondary school teacher, uh, trainees were recruited onto courses out of the 26,360 the government said were needed. Mr Deputy Speaker, you don't need maths to 18 to work out that's less than 50% of the target. <laughs> and furthermore, what I said in my question was that some subjects were missing those targets by, by 50%, yet in many subjects they are missing them by way more, for instance physics, which only met 17% of its target. So Mr Deputy Speaker, have you had any indication if the Minister plans to correct the record, and if not, how do you suggest I go about securing a correction? Oh, so Damien Hines was just basically talking out of his arse then. Well, I'm shocked. Truly, I am, you know, a Tory misleading the House. A rarity, yeah. I'll stop short of the Deputy Speaker because he didn't say anything really interesting. But what Manero Wilson said was very interesting, wasn't it? So what do you guys think? Let me know down below and I shall bid you farewell and take care, my friends.